Hello lovely yogis, welcome to Sash Yoga class. Today we will do sleeping pigeon pose. Let's start from easy pose. Let's put our hands forward, relax a little bit, put our head down. Then we will do sleeping pigeon pose one side. In this case, we will put our left leg forward, right leg goes all the way to the back straight. So we'll stay here for a few seconds and then slowly put hands in front of us and put head on our hands. So this is sleeping pigeon pose. There is some variation for this pose. You can use a strap and then put around your leg at the back. Bring both hands at the back. Grab a strap and pull the leg forwards to your body. When we're done with this pose, we will bring all both legs together and then we will go to Balasana, child pose. Now we will do the other side. So this is right leg forward, left leg all the way to the back, straight. Inhale, on exhale, we will put our hands in front of us and put our head on our hands. Now a little bit modification. Use a strap, grab the leg, bring both hands at the back, and then pull the leg forward. When we're done, you can stay here as much as you want. It's up to you guys. When we're done, we will this time go to extended puppy pose. So we will spread our knees, put toes together, Stay, leave our hips in the air and then put head and hands down. If this pose is kind of difficult for you, you can do some modification. You can sit down on your heels and then bring hands in front of you and put head down. So you, in this case, I'm sitting on my heels. It's also extended puppy pose. When we're done with this pose, we will lift our head up, always an inhale, we will go to child pose balasana, we will grab our heels at the back and then put head down. Make sure that you breathe guys when you're down. So after this pose we have to stretch our body because sleeping pigeon pose is very difficult. So we will do cat and cow pose. Cat pose, exhale, head down, on inhale, head up. This is cow pose, one more time. Let's go to cat pose, exhale, head down, inhale, head up. One more time. Let's go to balasana, head closer to the knee. Now we will bring one knee closer to our head. And then lift our leg in the air. We will grab with the left hand our right leg and pull up in the air. This is tiger pose. When we're done with this pose, let's go to balasana one more time. Inhale, now opposite. Left leg closer to our forehead. Then lift up leg in the air. Grab leg with your right hand and pull. Tiger pose. This is great pose to stretch our back a little bit. Let's go to Balasana one more time. Head down. On inhale, head up. Now we will put our head on the floor, hands in front of you, and we will try to lift our body a little bit on our head. Put hands together at the back and lift them up in the air. You can grab your legs and pull them closer to your body. When we're done with this pose, we will go one more time to Balasana, child pose. Grab heels, head down and breathe. That would be everything for today, sleeping pigeon pose. Don't forget to subscribe.